In this video, let us learn how to make color gradient and transparency gradient in Blender. To start with that you need to separate the workspace and open a material editor on the bottom side. And for me I will work on Suzanne, so choose any mesh you have. First add a new material to the monkey's head, and by default it will have the principal BSDF node. Now hit Shift A to open the add menu and look for the color ramp. This one is essential in gradients of all types. Once you add it, connect its color to the color socket in the BSDF. Now, looking at this node, you will see two color slides, and you can add more by hitting the plus icon. However, when we slide the black or the white color, it only mixes those two as a gray shade. So, to add the gradient effect we need a couple of extra nodes. Open the add menu again and look for the mapping node, then connect it to the ramp factor. On the mapping vector socket, add a texture coordinate node, and make sure the last one on generate type. Another node we need usually is the separate XYZ to manage the gradient axis. Now, if we go back to the color ramp node and slide any of the two colors in it, it will show the gradient on the monkey. You can after that change the black and white colors to anything in mind. You can also change the interpolation type from linear to B spline for a smoother gradient between the colors. The constant on the other hand, is used for sharp edges, so try them all to see the difference. For the transparency gradient, we have two methods. Both look the same with a slight difference. In the first method, let's head down to the alpha socket in the BSDF node. On it, let's connect the same nodes we used earlier, add a color ramp and connect its color to the alpha as shown. Then, if we select the ramp and press Ctrl T, the last shortcut is from the node wrangler add-on, and by the way, the add-on we mentioned shipped with Blender, so just check it from the settings. Let's delete the image texture cause there is no need for it, and replace it with a separate XYZ node, then make sure to put the coordinate on generate. Now, usually when we do normal transparency on any mesh, and we are on heavy like now, we switch the blender mode to alpha clip, and this will give you the exact result like the one on the screen. And we can after that control it by using an empty and connect it to the coordinate node on object type. However, to make the transparency shows as a gradient, we just need to change the mode to alpha hashed, and the same with the shadow mode under it. This will give you a decent result for a beginner to work on mesh animation or anything like that. The other method for transparency gradient is also similar to the previous two. First add a color ramp node and connect it to the color socket in the BSDF, and let us change the two colors in the ramp. Make the first one on any color in mind. I will put it on yellow, the other color. Let's leave it on white for now and decrease the alpha to zero, this will make it transparent. And again as before. Hit Ctrl T to add both the mapping and coordinate node and make sure the last one on generated type. Now if we slide the color in the ramp, the gradient should appear, but still no transparency. To get that, we need first to connect the alpha from the ramp to the alpha socket in the BSDF, and also head back the blend mode in the material settings and change it to alpha blend. To make the transparency more clear, change the white color to the same shade you used, in my case the yellow color, so just copy it with the hex code.
and here is the result, and though it's pretty good, I think it works the best with 2D surfaces and not much with others, like if we applied the same material to the monkey head, the result will look like this, it seems a bit weird, but this is what you have, there are other methods to reach transparency gradient, but we leave that for another video, and that's it, like the video if you still here, and reach me out in the comment section or on Instagram DMs, see you guys next time, stay sharp, goodbye.